All right, folks, we have a weird one. This may be the actual... Who was that? Okay, this may be the actual um, screen or may not be. This one is an annoying one. You may know this. This is the UX490U. It's infamous for having uh, cable breakage. The people at ASUS thought it would be nice to have it exposed like that. And I think that's what's happening. And basically no display. It works on external screen. The client gave us the full go-ahead. Do whatever it needs to get it working. But one thing I do know is that the, if I remember, the LCD cable is part of the goddamn um, screen, which I don't think you can separate. Or maybe you can. But I don't wanna. It's a lot of work. Uh, let's see if this works of the external. I might need to blur the screen. Let's do that and uh, blur. Okay. I just want to be able to shut the computer down if it's still working. Press the power button. Okay. Give me a sec. All right, so I'm back at this. Asus, uh, what's happening? I have no idea. So I think I left it at uh, the point of the point of one second. Yeah, at the point of um, connected to external screen, and left it at that. Okay. So we got one Type-C there. I'm going to reconnect to another section, the other side. <clears throat> okay, now I've got power connected to it as well. Good. Okay, what do I see on the screen? Anything? No? Okay, wakey-wakey. Trying to wake the computer up from sleep. Come on. Definitely it's on. I'll reconnect the HDMI, disconnect, and reconnect. Okay, so if my HDMI adapter won't work, I'll get another one. Here's another one uh, that was tested when working. Here we go, let's swap over. Okay, that's connected. Any difference? Wakey, wakey, computer. Come on, man. All right, I am going to shut it down. Okay. I think it's turned on by itself. Let me try one more time. Okay, power on.
So it's definitely on. Uh, the caps lock light is blinking. Unless I'm in the wrong HDMI input. No. That's the camera. <sighs> Come on, let's try this one more time. <clears throat> okay, here we go. I'm going to plug in the HDMI dongle. Screen input changes to the correct one. And nothing. Come on. <sighs> it's definitely on, in my opinion. Okay. Alright, I'm going to assume the computer works, okay? Forget this test. Because caps lock light is blinking, nothing on the screen. Okay, what we're going to do is this then. We're going to actually... I've got so many laptops here for jobs that are all open, like partially disassembled. It's crazy organizing all of them. Okay. Because we're waiting for parts and this and that. <sighs> okay, let's go ahead. Now we're going to have a look at the connection of the LCD, more like the ribbon cable in fact, see if it is internally damaged. So we're going to do a full removal of the motherboard. Okay, here we go. Battery is removed, it's the original battery. C22N and uh, 1623. Okay. Alright, let's keep his board components in one location. This motherboard is very this this uh, L C D connector is actually very hard to install one. Okay. And it's nice to have a recording of the job you do, then you know where to put the screws back next time you are putting it all back. Not that I do refer back to them, but sometimes I do. Okay, so it uses a M.2.2280 uh, 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 SATA. Yeah, that's the ribbon cable, that's the LCD connection. That's the one giving us all the trouble. Probably didn't need to remove this guy. Maybe we will put it back. That's the uh, fan. All right, we got a message on WhatsApp. What's important, guys? 
はい、OK Now, ribbon cable runs through there, this one. My assumption is this cable is where the issue is. Hello, Mr. Ken speaking. All right, we're back. So, uh, to remove that, this is the LCD, okay? So, I suspect this cable is getting damaged here. To show you in context if I'm right or not, we have a look at this properly. And this is actually like the flex gate issue, but way before Apple. Oh, another phone call. What's this, Zebra? Hi, Deborah. Sorry. Yeah. All right. So, this one quickly. Let's have a look. One quick look. That's in there like that. And this ribbon cable is part of the screen. And this is the bit that breaks often. Yeah. Okay, so for this one, let me have a quick look at the um, screen options. So what will we do if we need to get this up and going? UX for... <coughs> this was a UX uh, for 490U. Have a quick look online, UX490U. Yeah, this one comes complete with the cable. Yep, and there's no way I'm going to change the screen by itself. All right, so we're going to order a new screen, and that will fix the issue. But the issue with this model, unfortunately, is the ribbon cable does get damaged over time. Um, all right, we're going to leave it at that. So thanks for watching in this case, and when the screen comes, we'll do a part two. But that ribbon cable is the issue. They snap over here, they break, there are tiny cracks in there. Shouldn't be a big deal to replace that later on. Okay. I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to support this channel.